Welcome back everyone to Let's Play Dead Space. We are on chapter 10, the end of days. Last time I left off we went to the um... What's this place called again? The Crew Deck, right. Why is it called the Crew Deck? Isaac, I've located God the damn me! Found. <sighs> Shit! No good. That shuttle's brain dead. Someone removed the navigation cards. God knows why. There's three of them scattered around the deck. I'm downloading their locations. I can't access the doors from here, so you'll need a crew key. If you can find those parts, I think we can get that shuttle operational again. Brilliant! Oh, it's just brilliant, isn't it? Now, I'm actually not sure if this... No, no, it's a completely different place to where we were last time. I actually thought this was going to be, like, the beginning section again. Because I'm pretty sure we do go back to the beginning at some point. Maybe next chapter. Yeah, I was wondering where the shiny thing was in here. And I'm still looking good on plasma energy. Wonderful. This place looks horrible, full of dead bodies. What makes me think there's going to be flappers about? What was I going to say again? Anyway, yeah, we're doing the crew deck. What lies in this dark, magnificent place of dead bodies? This is like something out of Cthulhu. Cthulhu creations. Damn it, Lovecraft. I swear someone just played Twinkle Twinkle Little Star. I'm, I swear I can hear it. You may not be able to hear it on the recording, but I can definitely hear it. <coughs> By recording, I mean the video. What's with all the bodies? I know this is going to be a waste of time, but I'm putting them all in this corner. No, 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 you're not going to fly out. There we go, that's nice and lovely. I mean, seriously, there's like flipping eight bodies in this place. I just realised how long this could actually look. And I just realised, why are all the females wearing white and all the males wearing... That just looks disturbing. Why am I doing this? Wait, I just realised you're wearing bandages. She got louder. There's a lot of whispering going on in this place. I don't like it. Come on, come on, pile up. Okay, there's so much whispering going on all over the place. No, I don't want that thing. You, you do, you do. This is gonna work wonders. I wish this game had grenades now. Does you imagine if this game had grenades? Why? With the dismembering. I mean, let's look at this pile. This is magnificent. Then I think that's last body. Looks like it. One more for the king. There we go. Perfect. So what's through that door? Uh, I gotta walk towards it so I can actually see where we're going. Uh, looks like a place we're gonna visit another time. I'll leave you that. Okay, that's where the tram is. And uh, apart from that, that's just this thing. Oh, whipper blades! Come on, game! Oh, I'm actually curious. What's through, be through the door? Sleep box. Yeah, it looks like a place we come to next time. So I'm just going to steal that and leave. Store, store, store. Because I'm not carrying around so many ripper blades. It's just, that's just stupidity. I mean, look at this. They don't need this many. Okay. Oh my god, look how many whipper blades I've got in my safe just waiting, sitting there. I would oh, actually I'll uh, leave them there for now. Just in case I find a suit and all that. God, it's amazing. 
How's my lone thing actually looking? Oh, so there goes Lone Rex. I just saved. I could probably use the status, but oh well. Yay, lift! Yay, what's that? Text log. Let me read you text. What do you have to say? United we ascend. Is new notology a new hope or just another scam? By Kerry Fan Utterken. If you've been living on Mars for the past 200 years, you might have missed the fastest growing religious movement in history. Unitology boasts a following of millions, counts powerful CEO, CEOs and officials in its ranks. Claims 78 billion dollars of stock in multi-global companies and owns two of Earth's largest financial insti institutions. GPSG Financial and Unitas, Unitas Energy Investments. From its beginnings as a cult of personality, Unitology has become a respected a respected, established religion. Most people know the basics. 200 years ago, Michael Altman, a professor of anthropologically, I'm sorry for pronouncing that word completely horribly wrong, blew the whistle on what he claimed was the biggest cover-up ever initiated. God damn it, bow speak. Insulated, I don't know what that word says. Insulated, that's the word. By Earth Government. The discovery of an artifact or marker which proved beyond any doubt there is alien life in the universe, the government labelled Ultman a kook, but his claim struck a chord with some, and his mistress <coughs> oh, sorry people, I'm sorry. And his mysterious death soon afterwards fueled that interest. How big is this flipping thing? God Unitologists believe the marker contained a code, the key to internal life, through rebirth and ascension to heaven. The kicker is you have to die first. What? That's not... that's... lame. They say the government is hiding enigma marker somewhere, keeping its secrets for themselves across all of human space. Unitologists praise Altman's martyrdom and await the day God comes to take them to their new life beyond death. Your sounds pretty harmless, but like any cult, there's a dark side. Unitologists are ranked in the church. Nobody ever talks about it, but most of its critics believe there are at least three ranks above the average believer or initiate. With each new rank, more of the church's inner workings and research is revealed to a follower. And these ranks are achieved by one simple criteria, giving money and power to the Cthulhu. I mean, to the church. Think taking all your money's bad? The church also requires members to donate the bodies after death. My god, why is this? Why? What did I do with them? Nobody would say, and attempts to infiltrate the inner circle have failed. With their emphasis on transformation and rebirth, maybe we wouldn't like the answer even if they told us. One rumour that House of refuses to die says the church is funding a secret shipbuilding programme. Some claim to have seen the fleet. No documentary evidence has been supplied, but the Clements all, all say these manchurable ships, despite their huge size... What? That doesn't make sense. Sorry if you heard that. I was just moving my headset mic stuff. My um, volume meter, not the mic. Oh, save point. So it wants me to go that way, okay. Do I actually have a node? I have two nodes, okay. Interesting. Uh, grab, the, grab the energy. Uh, oh, those credits on energy. Look. Uh, Game, don't be bugging out on me with this. There, there's clearly credits in there. Oh my god, really? It's bugged on me. So what's before this door? Looks like it leads to a whole new area of where we're gonna go. Security. It's getting louder, that Trinkle Trinkle Star song. It's all around me! What the hell? You. Give. Give! Give! <laughs> I want my credits! You know what I'm gonna do? I'm going to save and then I'm gonna try it. 